Yeah, so it, as so often happens, uh, SAP uh, starts to put some pieces in place uh, in relation to their overall ecosystem to to help start collecting data, and that's uh, uh, sounds like what PFM has done. I know there's been some big initiatives to kind of pull it together. Can you describe uh, how the SAP uh, P tools are evolving and expanding? Yeah, absolutely. The SAP tools are constantly evolving and expanding. This is a big initiative for SAP to focus on the sustainability area. So the uh, the product uh, footprint management uh, solution set. Uh, is coupled with ongoing evolution in the regulatory environment, and SAP is progressing on this front to create even more comprehensive solutions that pull all the pieces together. Uh, so even more recently, just in December, a new tool set called the SAP Sustainability Control Tower was released. Um, the SAP Sustainability Control Tower addresses fragmented financial reporting head-on by giving companies tools to extend their top and bottom line optimizations to the green line based on the sustainability KPIs. So this is really helping to start pull together um, the, the goals that companies will have, the standards that uh, will be set for them, uh, and giving them the tools to help measure and track how they're doing. Uh, so using this data-driven approach, businesses can now embed sustainability throughout their businesses uh, and gain actionable insights across the value chain to enable transition to low carbon business processes, because clearly, Companies, as they come to learn how they're doing, they're going to need to take action to improve their their scoring. Um, within or with the sustainability control tower uh, approach, users can drill down into strategic areas within the company and across the business network uh, to make informed decisions uh, based on financial and pre-financial ESG style indicators. Um, An optimization can then be made between costs and greenhouse gas emissions. So that will be critical for corporations to support the initiatives that governments and regulatory agencies are looking for.